It all started in the late 80s with a local dealer named Eric Wright, aka Easy E. Easy was making good money hustling, and by 22, he already stacked around $250,000. NWA was one of the most legendary West Coast rap groups of all time. But after seeing his cousin get shot, he wanted to find a way out of the streets and go legit. At the time, rap was just starting to get popular with groups like Run DMC and the Beastie Boys making waves. So Easy wanted to get in on the action and started recording songs in his parents' garage. But Easy E knew he needed to build a team if he wanted to get any real buzz in the music industry.